Yo, what's up guys, this is Jordan. In this video, I'm gonna be sharing with you guys how to let go and trust the universe, guys. And the first thing you must understand is that the universe is a reflection of you because you are the universe, okay? And for you to let go and trust the universe, you must know what it is that you want. And you know, a simple formula that I've learned and I've applied is write down what you want, okay? Plan your work and work your plan, guys. And basically, when you know what you want, you don't have to sit there and be in control of everything, worrying about this, worrying about that, because you can let go of trust the universe knowing that you were divinely guided by the spirit and that the universe is working in divine order at all times, okay? So if you've made a decision and you've made it clear in your mind, believe it in your heart, right? If you made it clear in your mind, believe it in your heart, the universe is gonna do anything to make it happen because we are the universe, okay? The universe is the powers of the spirit or whatever you wanna call it, guys, but understand, you make the decision, you take action. When you take action, that's proving that you have faith in what you're writing down, okay? It's not really gonna work out for you if you don't believe it, but the thing is, how to let go and trust the universe is basically, for me, it's just taking action without thinking about the the expectation of the result or the consequence and you basically just you know what you want what is my goal ingrain your goal in your subconscious mind write down a goal card right and just take action continuously over and over and over and whenever you do one thing do the next thing right after how to let go and trust the universe is literally as simple as go out in nature and meditate guys if you guys are worrying if you have anxiety if you have fears you know, first thing I'm gonna recommend you to do is number one, I'm gonna I'm gonna ask you to eat better, okay? Eat some healthy greens, eat some dark berries, eat some high vibrational foods, raise your vibration and realize that everything that happens to you is in alignment of your vibrational frequency. So if you want better things to happen to you, if you wanna stop worrying, raise your vibration. That's number one. Once you raise your vibration, I want you to go out and exercise every single day. And you know, I'm not sitting here telling you what to do, but guys, I'm just giving you recommendations based off of what has worked for me. I hopefully this is gonna work for you. You know, it's something that's worked for me along my journey, raising my vibration, going out in nature, meditating, you guys should exercise every single day. I think that will really help you get to the next level. Exercise every single day. Increase the blood flow and oxygen to your brain, right? Raise your vibration. Eat healthy foods. Eat your greens and berries each and every single day. I'm not saying you have to be very strict on your diet, but understand, guys, that the foods you eat, whatever you fuel your body fuels your drive. So whatever you put in your body is how you feel, okay? So put in high vibrational foods, things that give you energy, not things that take your energy away. So, um, you know, focus on those berries and those greens, but go out into nature. And for those of you that have never tried this, you know, practice grounding. And, you know, grounding essentially what it is, how to let go and trust the universe is to ground. Put your bare feet on nature. Take off those socks, take off those shoes. I'm telling you guys, you know, not a lot of people do this, not a lot of people talk about this, but this is one of the most powerful habits that I've created and 333. And this is one of the most powerful habits I've created is actually taking off my shoes, even if it's for one minute, even if it's for five minutes, whatever the case may be, understanding that when you put your bare feet in nature, what's happening is um, the earth is balancing you out. So anything that's going on that is unbalanced, whether it's, you know, the whatever it's called, you know, whatever it's called, but understand if you're frustrated, you have anxiety, you have fear, the, the fastest way to fix that, hey Pips, I love you too, buddy. Look at look at this guy. The fastest way to fix your fears and anxiety is take off your bare, take off your socks and shoes, walk out into nature, put your bare feet on the earth, because what's happening there is your root chakra is opening and the soles of your feet are connected to your root chakra. And your root chakra, essentially, what it is, it, if your root chakra is closed, you have too much, you have fear, you have anxiety, whatever, but the way to open it up is that is by actually connecting your feet in, into the nature. So this is something that's very powerful. It's how to let go and trust the universe. One of the biggest tips I can give you is really going out into nature, meditating, guys, meditate daily. If you don't know what how to meditate, I recommend meditating, learn how to meditate because, you know, one thing I've learned is when you don't meditate, things happen, <laughs> problems, problems occur, 
And you know, meditation is a very powerful technique to filter out anything that's not serving you, okay? And meditation, for me, I like to do it after a workout. I like to do it first thing in the morning, first thing at night. Um, but what meditation does, it essentially, meditation is absorbing yourself into the present moment. So, you know, if you're worrying about th this and that, you're, you're probably thinking about the past and recreating into the future, which is giving you anxiety. And understand that presence is absorbing the present moment. That is pure consciousness. That's, that's where we reside is the present moment. And anxiety is worrying about the past, worrying about the future. And the way to stop worrying is to go ahead and put your feet in nature, raise your, raise your vibration, put your bare feet on the earth and go out into nature and meditate guys. Meditation in nature is very powerful very powerful because understand that when we're when we're at home when we're in the cities especially if you guys live in the cities you know you're surrounded by a lot of energy there's a lot of cluster going on pollution all kinds of energies so it's kind of hard to realize who you are when you got all this energy you know conflicting and distracting you and whatnot but when you go out into nature you're in the pure essence of the earth and that is that is nature's um, in its pure form right nature is a pure vibration of the earth Therefore, it is literally just you and nature, right? And we and we are nature, okay? So for you to really clear out your mind and, and stop worrying and let go and trust the universe, go out into nature, do a hike every morning, even if it's walking, guys, you don't have to run like me and Pips. Me and Pips run every single day um, just because I believe becoming your greatest version, you know, you should really push yourself in all aspects, mind, body, spirit. Um, but go out, at least walk, guys. You know, a month ago, two months ago, I was kind of a little bit out of shape compared to normal and I actually had to walk. I couldn't really run for very long at a time without losing my breath. But guys, you guys, maybe you're starting off like this, but understand how to let go and trust the universe. Realize that you are infinite, multidimensional spiritual being, having a human experience. We have the same exact infinite potential to grow and you know, there's nothing stopping you other than you. So get out of your own way. And the way to get out of your own way, let go and trust the universe. Put your bare feet on the earth Go out in nature, meditate, raise your vibration, eat some high vibrational foods, guys, positive affirmations, really reprogram your subconscious mind. You know, that's some things that I've learned that's really helped me. And I hope you guys got some value from this video, some things that have really worked for me. And for those of you that are new, if you enjoyed this video, go ahead and subscribe, hit the bell for more information just like this. I appreciate you guys. You can follow me on Instagram at infiniteabundance777. Much love, guys. Let's make 2020 our best year yet, baby. Let's get it.